The ASABE 40th Historic Landmark designation is the Cotton Module Builder. The Module Builder system has revolutionized the cotton industry and is currently used to harvest more than 99% of the United States cotton crop. Cotton was once transported from farms to gins by wagons, trucks, or trailers. With the development of mechanical harvesters, waiting for trailers to return to the field was a serious problem. Large numbers of trailers on the yard meant harvest delays, and trailers were an expensive method. Researchers at Texas Tech University developed the ricking system for storing prior to ginning. Ricking did allow the harvesting rate to be independent of the ginning rate. However, the density in ricks was low. The ricked cotton had to be loaded into trailers with front-end loaders. Trailers were still needed to transport the cotton. Professor Lambert Wilkes of the Department of Agricultural Engineering, Texas A&M University, developed the cotton module builder between 1971 and 1974 with the support of J.K. Farmer Jones of Cotton Incorporated. Harvested cotton was dumped into the module builder rather than a trailer. The seed cotton is compressed using a tramper. The density of seed cotton in the module was approximately 12 pounds per cubic foot, much higher than a rick. The early modules were formed on pallets, not on the ground. In order to transport the modules to the gin, tilt bed trailers were used. An early development in the module builder system was the module mover trucks. Pallets were eliminated and the modules were formed directly on the ground with minimal loss. Early experience showed harvesting would benefit from a bowl buggy that could be loaded in the field and allow the harvester to continue operating. The bowl buggy delivered the seed cotton to the module builder. This Model T bowl buggy was part of a demonstration by Dr. Calvin Parnell with the Texas Agricultural Extension Service in 1975. Here, the two researchers most responsible for the module builder system are shown participating in a demonstration, Lambert Wilkes and J.K. Farmer Jones. Today, the module builder system, including the builder, bowl buggies, module trucks, and gin feeder, is present wherever cotton is grown. The module builder system is essential for the production of cotton today. Today, cotton is king because of this ASABE engineering landmark.